Hi everyone, this is just a quick tutorial um, on how to estimate a sample regression line using Microsoft Excel, given that we have our data here in Excel format. Now, um, I'm using the same data sets for my um, full lectures on simple regressions, so we should be familiar with the variables and our results should be identical. Now the key to using regressions in Excel is to make sure that we have our data analysis toolbox um, installed. Okay, and to make sure that you've got your data analysis toolbox installed in Excel, you click on File, then you click on Options. From Options, we click on we click on Add-ins, and we want to make sure that our, we've got Analysis Tool Pack installed. So you click on Analysis Tool Pack, and then you click on Go. Now make sure the box for Analysis Tool Pack is checked, and then you press OK. Now, if you click on your Data tab you should have data analysis toolbox installed. So just click on data analysis and we have all these cool functions that we can use. But what we're using today is the regression function. So you click on OK. Now input Y range. This is asking you for your Y variable. So I'm going to highlight my Y variable, which in this case in our wages and education example is wages. So wages is our Y variable, our dependent variable. Input the X range. So the X variable is education. That's our independent variable. So I'm going to highlight education. Um, and then because we've highlighted the entire columns, we've also highlighted the labels, wages and education. So that's why I've checked the labels box here. And that's it. And then the output range, it's asking you where do you want your regression outputs to um, to be produced, so I just clicked on G2 and you press OK. And now we have our regression output. So you can see that we have our coefficients, we have our standard errors, we've got our T stats and so on, our R squares, and it's all here. Now let's do that one more time for our second data set. So in our second data set, we talked about grades and sleep, whether the number of hours of sleep you had the night before of the exam affects your grade in the exam. So let's quickly do this one. We click on data analysis. Um, click on regressions, OK, and we highlight our Y variable okay, for, as the first input. And then for the second input, our X range, we highlight our X variable or the independent variable. Um, again, we've checked labels because we've, we've included the labels in our input. And then the output range is G2, that's fine, and we press OK. And you can see, again, we get, we've got the exact same output as in my lecture, and, um, and that's it. So the key to it is to make sure that, you, that you've got your um, data analysis toolbox installed, okay, Look, using the add-ins, add -ins, and then also um, your data analysis toolbox will be in your data tab. Okay, good luck.